for the cast of He's All That, and we are about to play Choose Your Squad. Oh, yes. Okay. I'm terrified. <laughs> you know, <laughs> this is going to be a mess. Oh, man. Let's go. Okay, I'll be making stuff up along the way, but first off, Seth, super bad. Come on. Iconic. Like, I, can, I can't not have Seth on my team. Hey, Greg, why don't you go piss your pants again? That was like eight years ago, asshole. People don't forget. I love Seth. And along with that, I gotta have Michael Sarah. Are you kidding me? I mean, I gotta have all the people from Super Bad at this point, but okay, I'll have Seth and Evan. And then Maeve, Sex Education. I feel like she would really scare off the bullies. Oh! And she's super badass and super cool. And I feel like she would like make me seem cooler just by association. So I feel like that's important. Just to have some street cred. I mean, okay, fine. I guess I'll have Tanner. I'll have Robbie on my <laughs> squad. And like, I guess he has some martial arts training. Could come in handy one day, you know, fend off all the bullies. I'm talking like there's so many bullies in high school. Like you walk in, it's just like a sea of bullies, which is not true, but I'm just thinking like worst case scenario, we got the homies. And last but not least, I gotta have Eric. You gotta have that comedic relief, you know? Excuse me, I'm a bad girl in heels. A bad girl. Let it be known to the world. So many like hardcore people in the group. You gotta have like your homie. And I feel like Eric would be a real homie to me. So that's my squad. All right, let's go. I'll go Cher. Clueless is obviously an iconic movie. I love Cher. She's very, um, knows what she wants and is gonna get it. I love that energy. Ew, get off of me. Love her, love her fashion sense. Um, I'm gonna go with Olive from Easy A. I love that movie. I am about six seconds away from slapping you so hard, your teeth will bleed. Can you do it in front of everyone? She stands up for what she believes in and is not afraid of what people have to say about her, which is awesome. I'm gonna go with, I have to say Lainey, duh. Um, I love Rachel, she's incredible. Lainey is so sweet and so cute. I mean, iconic to say the least, so gotta say her. Um, I'm gonna go with, I'll say Damien from Mean Girls. He's awesome. Doesn't care what anyone has to say about him either. Also, not afraid to be different than anyone else. Not afraid to, to be himself, which I always love. And I feel like my squad is kind of like giving off that energy right now of just people that are relentlessly themselves and unapologetically themselves. And I'll finish it off with Seth from Superbad. Why would you not choose Seth from Superbad? I don't know why I didn't choose him sooner. I don't know how I just saw that. But uh, yeah, that's my squad. All right. First off, I have to go with Damien. I love him. I just think he's the best. He'd definitely keep it real. He'd tell you like the, the shit you need to know. He just tells you the facts. See, this is the color I want. This is Damien. He's almost too gay to function. Um, and then I'd have May from Sex Education. I just think she'd keep it real as well, but also like she definitely scare people off that like I don't mm. like. So like I can just kind of like hide behind her like, okay, hey, you can be the mean one for me. <laughs> and then nah, 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 I guess I'll go with Robbie. Just cause you know, I agree with Myra. You need that like the cute guy, but who can also like defend you, like kick some butt if need be. Um, this is so much pressure. Maybe Dion um, from Clueless. I love Dion. <laughs> I think she'd be so much fun. And another one who's just like very real. She'll tell you what you need to know. She's got that fashion sense. So when you're going shopping, like she, I feel like Maeve would just be like, I don't care why you're asking me, but she'd be like, no, that's ugly. You need to go with this. Shopping with Dr. Seuss? Well, at least I wouldn't skin a collie to make my backpack. Very helpful. <laughs> and then my last one. I'll go with Eric from Sex Education too. I, no need to explain. If you if you've seen Sex Education, you just know you need, he needs to be in your squad. Yeah. If you know, so you know. Yes. If you know, you know. First, I'm gonna pick Maeve from Sex Education. Uh, she's unapologetically herself, uh, kind, kind of like Cameron, and I think she's hilarious. Next, I'm also going to pick. Olive, uh, I think she's, again, unapologetically herself and kind of finds herself through everything and can be super honest with the friend. Third, oh, I gotta pick Brock Hudson. I gotta pick Brock Hudson. I mean, he's the guy that has, is the big personality. I feel like you can always put a smile on your face. I'm gonna pick Miguel from Cobra Kai. I mean, there always, there's gotta be a friend that everybody can kind of make fun of, right? He's not cool, Robbie's cooler. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> um, 
No shade, it's just the truth. Finally, let's pick Evan from Superbad. He seems like the logical one <laughs> out of all of us, so I feel like we, you need the logical one. This is fun. I'm doing Ferris Bueller, because this man can finesse everything. So Ferris Bueller, and then I'm going to do Seth and Evan, because you can't split up the duo. They need to stay together. I'm doing Brock Hudson for the comedy, and then I'm gonna do Regina, because who doesn't want Rachel McAdams rolling with them through the high school squad? I mean, come on. <laughs> That's my team. I'm ready for this. Ferris Bueller, okay? I relate to Ferris Bueller. You know, he knows how to handle a situation. He may be the reason why we're in this situation, but he knows how to handle it. You know what I'm saying? Are you yeah, sure he fun. I did hella <laughs> mileage onto that car. I don't know if he handled that super well. I mean, he, he keeps it fun though. Yes, he, he, he'd be the one like dragging the squad out to like some very fun but questionable activities. Speaking of other kinds of adventures, I would bring Lainey Boggs. Lainey Boggs is, she keeps it real, she's down to earth, and she will bring you to the really culturally interesting experiences, like, you know, a really cool po like poet skit. You know, we got Ferris Bueller, and then we got Lainey Boggs, both of us keeping it real. And then, definitely gonna have to have my dude Damien, because Damien has all the guys. Yes! He knows everything that's going on in high school he's gonna be like yo don't go to that party or he's gonna be like who guess what that girl's doing you stay away you know what i'm saying or be like that's not a good food bar to eat you might it might hurt you you know what i'm saying and then we have eric eric is the dude like like you said if you know you know you gotta have eric and then now oh i only have one more left oh this is so sad i i gotta have tanner Sorry. Oh, yeah <laughs> tell us if we don't is I'm he that kidding. great is he that great <laughs> i don't know Question. I mean, he can do a roundhouse kick. He can he can do some flying kicks. We'll give him that. <laughs> but, just be the bodyguard of the group. You know, yeah. when Ferris Bueller gets us in trouble, Robbie's there to get us out, and Eric is yeah. gonna smooth talk us, and Damien's gonna see the trouble from far away, and then Lainey Boggs is be like, let's just go watch a show somewhere. Yes. Honestly, guys. this was way more well thought out than I anticipated from you, Annie. <laughs> <laughs> I'm impressed. I'm really proud she of you. Thinks out, she thinks like out everything and small, small details. I hope you like our squad. Let us know in the comments what you think. Thank you for the game. Thank you for the game. Yeah. <laughs>